Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel, and if you're new, welcome to Redesign 16. So this is where I post about beauty, fashion, and lifestyle every single week. Uh, before we get started on this Get Ready With Me Summer um, Full Face of Makeup, please like this video, and please also don't forget to hit the subscribe button. So let's jump right into it. Hey everyone, so today's Get Ready With Me Day, I already recorded one, but somehow my phone deleted it, and I was very upset. <laughs> so, now I have to do it all over again, but that's totally okay. I'm pre-recording this, so I think this is the first week or the last week of June, and I'm trying to hit a goal of 100,000 views by July 1st. I'm so close. I only need like 12,000 more. I can't do it without you. So I need your help. So, and there's some new faces around here. Thank you for subscribing to my channel. I'm blown away by each and every one of you. So, yeah, so I already prepped my skin with my sunscreen and my LA Girl HD Pro um, Moist Nourishing Moisturize Nourishing Face Prime. So, I'm wearing sunscreen underneath my makeup because it's going to be super hot here today. So, um... I'm going to go in with my buff foundation, just a drop in my hand, and my light CC tan, so about a pump and a half. I'm going to mix that around, put it on my finger. This is the Make Sense Foundation and CC tan from Synergens and I will be using some Synergens products today and some drugstore products. For the Synergens products, um, I will put a link down below so that you will be able to shop each and every one of these Synergens products today. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to ask me. You can directly DM me on my Instagram account and follow me at redesign16. So, the light medium CC tan cancels out any redness in your skin. And I do have redness. So, I'm going to take my Zaconic Kesh flat top brush from Target and just start patting it in for an airbrush look. By patting it in, you're not actually causing wrinkles. If you were to swipe it, you would probably get red line, like streaking, and that actually causes wrinkles over time. So, and this Synergens Foundation and CC Tam, like, they, it, matches me so well and I have um vitiligo so if you've been around you know that I talk about it color matching me like the best ever but if you're just joining me this stuff is amazing and it has like cinnamon Cine complex in it their own synergens own technology so I'm just doing a quick and simple full face kind of summary look because that's what I did when I got deleted. So okay. So once that is all um, put on, I totally forgot to do my eyebrows. So, and you know that I do them in layers. So, I'm just gonna take Garnet Shadow Sense and put it over. Just like that. If you've been around for a while, you know that I do my brows in layers. 
So. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm trying to think. So, I'm going to use this e.l.f. Hydrating Camo Concealer. I am like running low. Usually I use candlelight shadow scents. Might put a little bit on my finger. It's a peachy undertone. It cancels out any redness, any darkness, uh, blues, discoloration. Um, yeah. Okay, and I'm using candlelight as my base. So I'm just putting it all over my eye. Actually got the old one, so I'm good. So if you don't know what Shadow Sense is, Shadow Sense is a cream to powder eyeshadow. It comes in this little tube. You have 60 to 90 seconds to apply before it sets into place. I wait like about 20 seconds to make sure it's set, and then I go in, and then I just go to town so i always start out with a base so i'm going to take a kind of fluffy brush i'm actually i cannot find oh here it is i usually use sorry my stomach this morning is growling I've been trying to like eat really healthy because I'm in all into nutrition and exercise. I've been for a while, but since this whole we had to stay home and so like I kind of went off the bag wagon and I gained a little bit of weight, which I'm not happy with, but I'm getting back on track and counting my carbs and doing all that stuff. And yeah. Okay, so now I'm going to take a little bit of this ELF HD powder. It's white, but trust me, it does not stay white. I'm going to use this for my setting. So I'm just gonna dip the pointy. And I'm going to take my makeup, or my uh, Brow Technique makeup sponge and just go to town. See, it's like really white, but it, it doesn't leave any residue. Okay, so that was done. that now I'm gonna use you can use shadow sense for multiple things just not your eyes oh um you have 60 to 90 seconds to apply it. it's grease proof waterproof sponge proof anti-aging has skincare in it layerable buildable so many good benefits so going to go in with clothes. This is from the Natural Nude Collection and I am just applying it as contour. So now I'm going to take my Ciccone Cash Angled Contour Brush and I'm just going to start making circular motions. Look at that. You can use it as eyeshadow and contour. And you can even use shadow scents on your lips. Oh, yeah, I was gonna show you something, but I don't know where 
it is. Okay. Hold that thought. Okay, so I'm gonna take my bronze dust. I did this yesterday and it turned out really well. So I put contour before I <laughs> applied it. And then I took my bronze, translucent bronze dust powder. And I just made circular motions. And this is the best powder I have ever used. It comes in six shades, comes in this little thing, has a top to it, but I can't find it. So, and if you think you got too much, you can just take your foundation brush and just lightly go over the spots where you think you got too much, but I love contour and yeah, it's like it's summer and I just, that's my, one of my favorite things to do. And it's a long lasting powder, anti-aging, sun protection. You still have to wear your sunscreen over it. So I am going to do clove one and done um on my eyes you don't need much of this a little bit goes a long ways and i'm going to go in with um, this brush i'm just going to blend it start blending it you can pat it in but I started to pat it in, but you can, since I'm doing a one and done, well, I'm going to add snow to it on the inner corner. Um, I thought I had a different brush. I did, but I don't. <laughs> so, the one good thing about these is that if you don't think you have enough on your eyes, you can add more. So, I'm going to add a little bit more to make it a little bit darker. And yesterday, when I was pre-recording this, I couldn't find clove, so I think it was like meant to be. So, I'm just going to take the same concealer brush and just apply the shadow sense over. Usually, if I was using different colors, I would pat it in, but I'm doing a one and done, simple and easy color. So now I'm just going to put, top it with a matte lip sense lip gloss. This is called uh, Praline Matte. It is sold out, but we have several other matte glosses. Okay, and this is so silky <coughs> that is not so silky. And our lip glosses, all of our lip glosses have uh, shea butter and vitamin E, uh, so they will leave your lips hydrating and moisturized. As I just spit all over my face as I'm talking. So, that is that. So, I'm going to use, 
another. Mm. Okay, this is um uh, pink posy. I'm using this is also a shadow scent, and I'm going to be using it for blush today. So I'm going to take that angled contour brush and just lightly bring it up and bring it down mix really motions okay and then I'm going to take this palette I got a while back from Ulta Beauty I will try to link or link it put it in the description box the name of it just going in with this kind of looks orange on camera but it's like really pink I'm just gonna go over that okay I am almost done now I'm running out of time so now I'm going to go in with my e.l.f. Wow Brow. This stuff is amazing. So, no, oh, I totally forgot to do my eyeliner and my mascara. So, I'm using the Mixins Black pencil it is smudge proof waterproof it is the best eyeliner i have ever used so okay now i'm going to go like that Hurry here, sorry. Oh, blooper. So I'm using the Lash Scent Regular and the Waterproof Mascara. And yes, these are my real eyelashes. You can do up to two, three layers of mascara. Okay, I wanna show you something. That is the first layer, look. There we go. Did you see that? Like, amazing. So now I'm gonna do, do one little coat of waterproof. Okay, now I am going to put snow in the inner corner and you don't need much of this. And there we go. I'm going to clean up here and come back with the end result for you guys. Okay, so I'm back with the end result and this is how it turned out. So simple, so easy. I love how it turned out. Um, I got a little bit of stuff right there and I don't know what it's from, but I'm going to fix that off camera because I'm in a hurry today. So this is how the look turned out. Please give it a thumbs up or a like. Please hit the subscribe button and please also don't forget to ring the bell. I will post a link down below so that you can shop this look. It's so simple and easy with all the Cinegens products. And if you have any questions, please don't hesitate to ask me. That's what I'm here for. So thanks for watching.